بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم نحمده ونصلي على رسوله الكريم I greet you on this the 14th day of the month of Rabiul Awwal uh, with Assalamu Alaikum wa Rahmatullahi wa Barakatuh uh, The audio in this uh, recording will not be good because I don't have a clip on microphone so do please bear with me I'm going to speak a little louder and this is a video in connection <coughs> with my lecture which is scheduled for Yawm Al-Ahad Sunday, uh, September the 22nd in Ilfan at the time of Maghrib and our topic is a very very important one. It is not just Hinduism and Akhirul Zaman, more than that, it is Modi Hindu India and Akhiru Zaman. This lecture is particularly important for Hindus in India, for Muslims in India, uh, for Pakistan, for Bangladesh and for that region of the world. Because we're not dealing with the past, we're dealing with the future. Akhiru Zaman. And <coughs> what are the implications of secular India, which was born as a secular state, now having a religious leadership, like Israel, which was born as a secular state, and now the same thing has happened to Israel. You have a religious leadership. So a religious party leading a secular state, both in Israel and in India. <coughs> and in this video, we're going to look at the differences as well as the similarities between Israel and India, particularly since Modi, Narendra Modi, has become the Prime Minister and taken control of power in India. One of the most important things that we will deal with in this lecture is the Great War which is coming. Uh, the Malhama otherwise known as Armageddon. And what is our analysis of what Israel is likely to do and India is likely to do at the time of that great war? There are perilous implications for Pakistan and therefore for nuclear war in South Asia. And I do hope that you will make the effort to come to attend this lecture on Yawm al-Ahad on Sunday. It is the last lecture I'll deliver uh, before I travel back to Trinidad. And uh, I have not lectured in London for the last three, four months. So I look forward to seeing you, inshallah, on Sunday in Ilfad at the Muslim Community Center at the time of Maghrib. Thank you. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.